Hello everyone! So it occurred to me the other day that there are a lot of TV shows that I'm trying to get through all at one time. I don't think I'm probably the only person that has this problem, but I'm just gonna talk about and list some of the ones that I'm trying to catch up on. So first on my list is um, Supernatural. Um, I'm actually kind of taking a break from Supernatural right now because there are other ones that I want to get through faster, but I'm watching it with my friends Chrissy and Izetta, and we're still on the first season. We started it last semester. First season's kind of scary. I can only watch it a little at a time, um, so I don't really know how I feel about it yet because I don't really like scary, but I'm told that it's not like that all the time, so I'm going to get keep giving it a chance, but I'm kind of iffy on it right now. The um, reason I'm not really watching Supernatural a whole lot right now is because of my second show, which is Game of Thrones. I got season one for Christmas, and I waited until Chrissy and Izetta could watch it with me because they both are in the process of reading the books. I think Izetta might have already read all of them, I'm not sure. First season's only ten episodes, and we've watched four of those, I think. And I really like it so far. Um, I haven't really watched a lot of shows where they show like that much nudity because it's an HBO show and that's allowed on there. Um, so it's kind of weird getting used to that, but it's not a bad show and I really like it so far. I'm not really sure who my favorite character is yet because I'm still kind of getting to know some of them a little, but I like it. Christy Azetta and I are also in the process of watching Avatar The Last Airbender. Both of them have seen it before, but I have not, so they're watching it with me because they, they said I really needed to watch it and so I am. And I can't remember how far we got. We're still on season one, but I think like nine or ten episodes in, I want to say. I'm not sure. It's been a while since we've watched it. I haven't watched a lot of shows with this kind of animation style, but I like the story a lot so far, and I like trying to toy with the idea of what kind of bender I would want to be, and I'm not sure. I'm kind of stuck between water and air. I think I'm not sure which one I'd rather be, but uh, it's, it's a cool show so far, and I look forward to getting further into it. And the three of us are also making our way through Friends. I've seen Friends a whole lot, and we've all, we've all seen it, you know, at least parts of it. But Friends is just a really good filler show because it's short. Since a lot of the other shows we're watching are just very full of emotions and feels and stuff, Friends is a good kind of, like, thing to watch in between stuff so that way you can kind of laugh some of that off. And we're on season two right now. I own all 10 seasons, so we're just going through my DVDs. Three of us are also, we watch a lot of TV, the three of us are also uh, watching season three of Once Upon a Time. I've already finished it because I watched it uh, on my own first, and then once Chrissy got caught up with season two on Netflix since I have Hulu Plus, and Izetta hadn't seen any of season three, so I've been re-watching season three with them, and it comes on in less than a month, and I'm just really excited because... It ended on such a daunting cliffhanger and I need to know how they're gonna fix all of the things and how it's gonna how they're gonna push forward with the story. I'm just so anxious for it to come back on. It comes back on March 9th, if you're curious. And that's probably my favorite show out of all the ones I'm watching with them right now. As far as by myself goes, I was watching Once Upon a Time by myself, but not anymore. I'm also making my way through How I Met Your Mother. I'm on season two. Uh, I've been kind of watching this for a while. I used to use it as like in-between stuff whenever I was catching up on Doctor Who, which I'm already caught up on. Been for a while. And so I just kind of watch it every now and then, but now that I don't really have anything else to watch by myself, I might start watching more of that because it's really funny. And then Chrissy and I are making our way through Classic Who because we discovered that most of the seasons, in fact all 26 seasons minus season four, five and 23 are on Hulu Plus and we just discovered this a couple nights ago so we started season one 1963 with the first doctor and I can't wait to learn more about the actual original show and what started it all. So far I'm not really a big fan of the first doctor I mean he has his moments where you see you know the doctor you know and love come out but he's kinda mean sometimes and whenever I'm watching him and I watch some of the things he does I realize just how much he has to learn to get to where he is currently. Um, so it's it's kind of weird and trippy, but I cannot wait to keep watching Classic Who. I'm just so excited that we found it. Current TV that I watch, I watch Grey's Anatomy and Scandal 
I still watch Glee. I'm not really sure why, but it's not like super big on my priority list. Um, Revenge and now Once Upon a Time. Uh, those are really the only shows that I keep up with currently. Um, and Glee, Grey's Anatomy, and Scandal all start up again next week, I think. So I need to rewatch the last episode of each of those because I can't really remember what happened. It's been a while. Been before Christmas, I think, since they've been on. So I'm excited. Let me know some of the TV shows that you watch and or are trying to catch up on through various online sources down in the comments, and I'll see you next week. Bye!